Have you ever handed your camera to someone at an important event, like say a wedding or a party or a concert, and ask someone to take your photo or film your video, video and somehow they've stuffed it up and they've changed the settings or they've pressed the wrong button? Ah, so frustrating, right? Well, if you're sick of that happening, you definitely want to check out Archive Mode, which is one of the awesome features that you can put on your GoPro Hero using GoPro Labs. Archive Mode, or Idiot Proof Mode, as I call it, means that if you hand the camera to someone, they can only turn the camera on to record or off. Setting up Archive Mode on your GoPro Hero using GoPro Labs is super easy, and in this video, I'm going to show you how. So first of all, we're going to go to the uh, GoPro Labs website and here's the address here at the top of the screen and we're also going to include it in the description down below. You want to make sure you have GoPro Labs firmware uh, installed on your camera. If you're not sure how to do that, click on the link at the top of the video right now and I'll take you step by step through setting up this awesome feature called GoPro Labs. Okay, so from this page we're going to scroll down to where we have this one here where it says camera macros and we're going to tap on that link there it's going to bring up this new page here now on this new page we're going to scoot down to where it says miscellaneous features and this first option here is called archive mode so it's a video only capture mode and this is super super cool what it does is it limits uh, your camera to only the quick capture button being um, being able to be used so by scanning this QR code, they can just use it at the start or stop filming, for example. Nothing more than that, and they can't change uh, any of the uh, selections that you have chosen. To do that, all you need to do is set your mode customization here. So for example, here's a bit of a key here, like R4P, it's like R for um, resolution, uh, P24, that will shoot it at 4K at um, 24 frames per second but you can also go into this link here the QR control customizer and you can actually uh, tailor make it the way that you want it exactly and then when you're happy with that this is going to be uh, the QR code that you're going to be using so you could like copy this QR code here and copy it to the clipboard as well of course Go back into here, we can input this, and that has now created this unique QR code that we can scan. So it means that your person who you hand the, uh, the camera to will be limited to the features that you've just specified. All you need to do now is hold up your GoPro camera, which has got GoPro Labs installed, uh, in front of this code here, and it will put your camera into archive mode. Now when you're done, when that person's handed you back the camera and you want to you know, use it as a normal GoPro camera again, just come back to this page and this time you want to unclick enable archive mode and then you want to scan that and your camera will be set back set to working the way it was before. Archive mode really is a godsend and is one of the awesome, awesome things that you can add to your camera using GoPro Labs. To learn more about GoPro Labs and even like getting the most out of your GoPro Hero, you want to click on this video over here right now. As usual, thanks for your company and I'll see you in the next video.